Hi, my name is Chesit Thai Pawan and from Thailand. Today I would like to show you how to install Antidex Remote Desktop on Raspberry Pi. Now I'm using Raspberry Pi 4 and I'm remoting to my Raspberry Pi uh, via VNC. But VNC has the limitation that uh, you have a local network. In case that you want to remote uh, from your mobile phone from um, <coughs> outside, you have to install any deck. Okay, let's get start. First of all, you have to uh, click uh, the browser and uh, using Google to search any deck and pie. Click at the first result and click here download and select this one. Okay, and you see this, let click keep. And now you can uh, click this file to uh, begin to start installing. Uh, click install. And uh, you have to type uh, your Raspberry Pi password. By default is Raspberry Pi. And wait for a few seconds. After you install finish, you should see the AnyDeck icon show here as this. Okay. But if you don't see it, okay, in, in some case you don't see it, you can try to click this icon and <coughs> run and tie any deck directly here. And you should see here now. Now uh, you are ready uh, to use the any deck, okay. In this case, uh, I use VNC to remote uh, my Raspberry Pi first, and now um, I will uh, back to my uh, PC. Uh, I'm using MacBook, and I will uh, open any deck on my MacBook to remote to uh, my Raspberry Pi and. Um, I think this is uh, the AnyDeck ID. Okay, I will double click, and uh, you should see some message. It means that you have to uh, open or remote or use a monitor to open your Raspberry Pi to click accept. Yes, I think that you have to uh, think uh, it's not work because you uh, still have to. Um, Click accept by uh, using uh, some other remote desktop or using the uh, external um, monitor. Monitor. Uh, in this case, uh, we will resolve this by uh, set any deck to uh, have the personal password. In this case, uh, next time when you want to remote to your any decks, okay, um, you just tie the password that you set. Okay, and it will uh, not ask you to uh, accept, uh, click accept button any, any, anymore. Okay, in order to do that, uh, you have to click this uh, and it, in, in any deck of your Raspberry Pi and go to setting. And then uh, click security and uh, if you never install any deck before, you should see uh, some icon here. Uh, that you have to click is uh, allow you to unlock the security. You have to click and you would be asked uh, to tie the password and tie your password uh, of your Raspberry Pi and then uh, go to this. You have to enable an uh, unattended okay? and tie the password that uh, next time you have to uh, tie in order to uh, exit uh, your Raspberry Pi via any decks. Okay, in this case, I will tie my password. Okay, and click OK and close. And now, okay, I will uh, close uh, my uh, VNC. Okay, and in this skin, uh, now you are now, now I am in uh, my Mac, Mac, MacBook desktop, and 
I am remoting uh, my Raspberry Pi via Nidex. Okay, and now I will close this section, and I will reopen Nidex again, and show you that uh, in this time you don't have to uh, remote or uh, open the monitor of your Raspberry Pi to click accept, but you would be asked the passwords. Okay, you have to tie your passwords that you set. Uh, previously, uh, and in order to avoid uh, tie the passwords in the next time, you can click here to um, around next time to log in uh, automatically with uh, the old passwords. Okay, let's be tie password again. And that's this. Okay, this is how to uh, install and using uh, any deck on Raspberry Pi. Um, in this video, I using uh, the Library Pi 4 and uh, it's quite smooth. <laughs> okay, thanks for watching. Okay, bye bye.